All right, we got our Volkswagen. It's a 91 Jetta Volkswagen manual transaxle. This one, it's kind of odd, but where we start is here in our casing, we have our input sha shaft coming in, which is actually this shaft right here. So the power will come in through the input shaft. Um, for first gear, the power is gonna come up right here to this first gear here, jump over to here. So this will be the first gear pair. Um, and then it's gonna go down to, there's a gear down there, over to our um, drive, pretty much our final drive, um, which will then transfer it out to the um, wheels. Um, moving up to second, this one actually, oddly enough, they put reverse right between first and second. So when power, when you go and shift into second, it's gonna go up here to this gear pair. Power's gonna come in, hit second, it'll get locked in by the synchro. Um, it'll, power will come over here, it'll transfer back down, back to the final drive. Third, pretty much the same thing. Power will come straight up over, the one above second, straight over, down, into our gear, straight over to our final drive, out to the CV axles. Um, fourth, you guessed it, straight up, up, up here to fourth, Get locked into the synchro, power will go over, down, over to our final drive, out to our CV axis, out to the wheels, and onto the road. Um, this one on for reverse, what they did was they put our idler gear, it's our reverse idler gear right here, and it will lock this gear right here, and this gear right here. It'll lock, this one will lock to this one, and this one will lock to this one, but those two aren't touching, so it will pretty much be um, where this one is spending, say, counterclockwise, this one will go um, clockwise, and then this one will be going counterclockwise, which will actually making this go the opposite, which will be going clockwise, so it'll be complete opposite of our input shaft.